Hello everyone and welcome to the first session of Naughty to Add tutorial. Well, when I call it this Naughty to Add, people will say what it is. It's a microcontroller. This chip on this board was developed from ESP8266 chip by 5 when it belonged to Epicid. It's what called ESP32. Anyway, if you never use board of it, I think everyone who are watching this video know I don't know. Because it is similar to yours, you can code it on Arduino IDE. You see, it is very easy to use. Moreover, it's what created by Thai people. I am find a lot of love. I'm very proud of this bot. As I am Thai people, I think you should to support them too because Thai people do and Thai people use it's very nice. And if you are looking for this board, you can buy from Ayala Farland and Gavitek Thai. Let's see this picture. I will show you how special not T2S is. Did you say this? But chat is tell you this bot can shut but leave. I will show you how it can work. It's mean you can get power into this bot two way. First, this connector connect to the mini USB from your PC or power bank and this connector from Lipo battery okay Our I will plug the USB with my PC and then you will see the LED yellow LED, yellow color yeah it's mean it can work and then the Lipo battery I use T six one. You can uh I will connect it to this spot. Oh wow! It's shocking color card. I already shot it. Ooh. <laughs> uh, if it show you red color, it mean this board charging this battery okay uh you need to know the power the length of power it need to use about the lipo battery that you will connect it uh it is bit it here between two two point two one two t point six one and it calculate t point t one Okay, <laughs> I think it's compatible to you with GPIO up to 30 pin and moreover it has Wi-Fi and Bluetooth just one single word wow and it has humidity and temperature sensor on pin number 4 and 5 and it has capacitive touch sensor up to 10 pin wow uh it time it time to pay no t2s together uh make sure that you install espt2 in your arduino ide and this video i will show you how to send the temperature and Arduino IDE data to the under the I/O and use this use this web page under the I/O to control the LED on this board. Okay. We will care about temperature and humidity sensor on this board. Uh, first, you need to download the library of this sensor. From this web page, you we'll click this link, humidity and temperature, and then you will get it. I will leave the URL of this web page below this YouTube, okay? And the second level you need to download is this Ando ESPT2 Arduino. You click on download and download zip 
and then you will get it and go through the document I don't know library and then you dot to library that you just download here okay and then you try I don't know to open it Okay, we will tell the example of the library up to library this. Okay, you go to the example and find the name of temperature and humidity sensor first. Okay, let me in this SME humidity temperature. Okay, uh, first you need to configure the pin number of this board that has temperature sensor and humidity sensor okay are you here and this you try in for in five because it is on pin number four and five okay and LED on this board is on pin number two okay and uh, when it working is will blink on this board uh, along this and you slow the pin to show the temperature and humidity on the serial monitor okay uh, i will shine the uh, variable name to get understand you see at high humid and then I try it humid um yes I shine through term and this Okay, and don't forget to shine this too. You copy this, copy, and shine it to Tim. Okay, and then you don't forget to share this. Uh, this two you choose part node t2s and part you show this and upload speed you should okay and then you can upload this okay it show you done uploading and then you click this seal of monitor it will show you temperature and humidity now Okay, and then you will see this. It blink the second. We will apply the apply to be the member of Anto.io. Okay. Okay, let's go to the Anto.io webhead. You can find it from the Google. Okay. And then you click this. For a new member, you need to sign up. And then create your personal personal information, and then create a new account, okay? And then you log in and sign, okay? Uh, at first, you need to create thing list. It's similar to the topic that you want to use, okay? You click create new thing, and then for the name, it's up to you. But I, I add. No, T through S and the question I apply electronic broad and how about it not to share anything okay and then you click add new but I already has it's okay I click cancel uh when you have this pay like this click this on action and then you need to create a channel of your being list to okay uh for me i will show you to send the data 
template and humidity from this board okay and control the LED from this web page to okay it has to wait you can send data to this web page and you can control from this web page okay um, you click create new channel and name is up to you for me I a tie community template and LED to get understand what I do okay and um, when I use LED I at uh, about time I use switch on off but for temperature and humidity is just a uh, normally uh, you can use integer or forward but I, I use for because about temperature and humidity can be a uh, forward number okay and then you add new okay but i has already okay i had it already and then you will get this page like this it will show you the name that you added and description and tie that you choose added uh the this page will show you okay the action you click just to check what you what you added if you think it it not it not it is just in collects okay you can edit it but if it not you can cancel okay and then you go to key and click create the key you choose lead and update for everything that you add it okay and then add new okay uh, i already have the key and you can show the key and copy key to to copy copy this to code on your i don't know okay and then you can add up on your dashboard by as new widget you will see it has many shots for you to choose static test dynamic tech uh you can show in gap get token switch or like uh any anyway for you up to you okay i i choose dynamic tech you click add new this will happen for you this uh you can decide and then you click it uh, about Texas is about um, what the data come from you need to shoot what what uh, what the data that you want to show it uh, I I think I will show humid humidity and I shine it to person and this i can shine it shine color and take yeah and then you click apply but i have it already i, I will close and close okay and then we will see our original ide uh first you click example um is this anto is pt to i don't know basic mqtt okay here is the information that you should to add it ssid password user token thing okay ssid about um the name of your wi-fi for me is is a Quan Zai Zero Two. I I connect it. I connect it now. Okay, and it's password of your Wi-Fi and username that you use to log in the Anto.io and the token is the key that you copy and paste. And thing is about topic that uh, I I use Note T2S. Okay, um and 
in enter the MQTT loop, I will drop the temperature and humidity code that I use to this. Okay. Um, I already created a sample up for this. Okay, what you need to change it for first, if you want to control the LED on this board from this web page, you need to use sub. Okay, you use enter the MQTT dot sub. Uh, in this, you use the channel that you create uh, I, I create LED one okay um, in this loop I put this code about temperature and humidity and this I create the condition that if the data data does about temperature and humidity is more than or equal to zero and then we'll public send the data temperature and humidity to the enter.io okay um but, uh, when you need when you want to send the data you need to use pub pub enter the mqdt.pub and this is the uh, channel that you create the name already okay and this is the variable that you want to send data uh, and this uh, I, I use temp to get the data from temperature sensor and humidity for get the humidity sensor okay I use this this variable this either channel okay um when you when you um code it already you upload it okay it show done uploading and then you click serial monitor okay um in this course it will sell the bin time to connect um the name of the, the wi-fi that you connected okay and this i will show you uh the led on this board this is uh, already show and i will show you how to control it okay it is a uh, switch okay the LED click this yeah you see it disappear and click again it show you okay and this is the data that uh, sent from this board you will see it's it same data humidity and temperature sensor and you see on the dashboard it shows you okay um, um don't forget something uh, I, I will show you uh, about this type if you use fold on this variable humidity and in this course You need to use for two. Okay, if you use different type, it will not work. Okay, okay, I, I will end this video. Thank you for watching this video. I will. I hope you will enjoy to use this bot and the enter the I O. Okay, bye bye.